Hi, I'm Dr. Greg Castello, Board Certified Family Practice with CostelloWellness.com, and we're going to talk about metformin and longevity. And this is several studies in the past have alluded to this in animals that we know that if you give nematodes or worms metformin, they age much slower and exhibit healthy behavior for a much longer lifespan. Uh, rodents or mice given metformin also live significantly longer and have less cancers than mice who are not given metformin. The first human evidence of this is actually several years ago in a UK PDS study. So United Kingdom, they gave diabetics metformin versus diabetics other diabetes medications, and they noticed that metformin decreased the risk of heart attack and death in diabetics. Later on, they compared these diabetics who took metformin to non-diabetics who did not take metformin, and surprisingly, the diabetics actually had less death than healthy individuals not on metformin, uh, and the thought was that metformin had some other anti-aging uh, benefits. We're not sure what the cause of this is. There are actually now the first human trials approved by the FDA looking at metformin not as a diabetic drug, but as an anti-aging medication. It may be in metformin's inherent qualities it lowers glucose, it lowers insulin levels, makes you more sensitive, and insulin is similar to a hormone called insulin-like growth factor. And bodybuilders will use this to get bigger, but we know that IGF um, also stimulates the production of tumors, so shutting down or decreasing insulin levels may have a anti-IGF insulin-like growth factor effect and decrease uh, gene expression, so actually turning off potential cancer cells. Uh, there's some thought that uh, metformin actually has an oxidative effect. So we think normally about antioxidants, fruits and vegetables and vitamins, blocking oxidative stress or the radicals of oxygen consumption that you use for metabolism. And we know that free radicals of oxidation are bad, so taking an oxidant, antioxidant may be beneficial. Metformin actually has a slight oxidative effect, so opposite of an antioxidant medication, and there may be some benefit to this. So a question also arises, if I take an antioxidant regime with metformin, am I negating the beneficial effects? Um, the problem will be in looking at this is that it takes many, many years to compare groups of people to decide if they had less cancer, less heart attacks, less stroke, or lived longer. So we're not going to have any immediate results with this. But if you're a diabetic, I love metformin. It has amazing benefits. It's safe. It's inexpensive. Uh, the question will become, can we use metformin in non-diabetics to decrease their cancer risk? And that we'll find out over the next several years. Dr. Greg Castello, thanks.